shot. And today I'm going to be doing a video on how I got this twist out using the new Eco Styler Black Castor Oil and Flaxseed Gel. So, I'm going to show you guys first what I used um, with the gel so that you can you guys can know what I use. A lot of people said they can't find um, any products and they leave in to mix well with the um, gel, so I'll show you guys what I use. This one probably isn't helpful because the label is all off of here, but this, I think this is the Carol's Daughter um, Hair Melt Leave-In Conditioner. Not sure, but that's what I use for the leave-in. Then for the cream, I use the True by Made Beautiful Hydrating Hair Butter. This stuff is amazing. Okay. And then I might use some extra virgin olive oil because I wanted to seal everything in. But, um, yeah, that's pretty much everything that I used. Um, so, yeah, um, if you guys want to know how I got this twist out, then keep on watching. So this is a new Eco Styler Castor Oil and Flaxseed Gel. This is a consistency. It's like it's really thick and it's very jiggly like jello. So I actually put it in my hair and I forgot to press record. So actually I put way more than that in my hair. This is just me adding extra to my hair. But as you can see, it um, really, really defined my curls. I was, I'm going to show you that at the end of this clip. But it really, really defined my curls. So you can see my curls are popping. And you'll see in the back that I actually added way more gel. I just repeat every single step. I just add some water to my hair, make sure it's wet. Then I add my leave-in. Then I add my um, cream, the hair, the hydrating hair butter. Then I add my olive oil. Olive oil is a bay, okay. Then I just add my gel. And I just make sure I just like really, really smooth that into my hair. And you can see that it actually um, makes my hair like super, super stretched. So you can see that it's really defining my curls and it's really going to clump my curls together. When I got to the ends of my hair, I just like added a little bit more gel at the ends and just twirled them around my finger just to make sure my ends curl up a little bit better. When you are adding your gel, you want to make sure that you're really smoothing your hair down. That's going to help your hair to be more shiny. It's going to help it to not be so frizzy. It's going to help your curls clump together. That's going to give you so much definition. You can see as I smooth my hair down, I get more and more definition, more shine. And no, you see no frizz in my hair, okay? So, so smoothing is really going to help your hair to just have the best, the fine curls that you can possibly have, okay? Even when I'm twisting my hair, I smooth my hair down when I'm twisting so that it stays smooth. So when I'm doing the front of my hair, I just slip my hair down the middle instead of doing the whole entire section um, in one big old section because it's just too big of a section to do the whole thing. So I just put it down the middle and then I'll end up having two twists. My hair, when it is completely done, um, yeah, I'll show you guys what it looks like tomorrow in the morning when I take my twist out.
guys so much for watching. Please give this video a like. Please give this video to um 30 likes. Let's give this video to 30 likes, please. And subscribe to my channel. Please keep, click the little bell so that you'll be not notified when I post. And follow me on Instagram. Follow me on Snapchat. Um, everything will be down below. If you want to do any collabs with me, just um DM me or email me. DM me on Instagram, email me, you know what I'm saying? And um, yeah. Bye guys, thank you guys so much for watching. We're going on.